everyone, just a quick video here. And this video is inspired by Big Clive. I'm a big fan of his YouTube channel. I watch yeah, most of the new videos that he puts out. And a couple of times he talked on his channel about these things that you can um, sometimes now find just disposed in the street, uh, which is a bit of a shame. Um, well, for, well, let's say ecologically wise, because they contain a lithium cell and they um, encourage you to pick them up and take them apart just uh, to get the lithium cell out. Um, and uh, that's what I'm going to do here in this video. Now, these things, if you don't know what they are, they are um, yeah, devices that people use to inhale the um, yeah, vaporized substances that are available in all different kinds of flavors. And these days you have rechargeable ones but you also have disposable ones which is a bit of a crime <laughs> i think it's really yeah it's a shame that these type of devices are allowed but people just throw them out in the street so sometimes you can just find them laying around this one i actually didn't found it on the street i found it on the courtyard so i live in an apartment building um a, yeah complex let's say and we have an inside courtyard and this one was just lying in the courtyard so i think somebody must have thrown it over the fence because i cannot imagine one of the residents just chucking a uh, thing like this in the in their own private courtyard um so i at the yeah i was lucky at the moment i was carrying a sort of um a commercial folder so i used the paper to pick it up because yeah you have to take into account that somebody put it in his mount, right? It was also raining at that time, so that's why it's a bit dirty. It has grass on it and uh, as well. Um, so I'm going to clean it up and just put it temporarily in a paper in a plastic bag for hygiene purposes. So if you take these things apart, keep the hygiene in mind when you pick them up. But um, I'm just gonna quickly clean it up a bit and um, rub a bit of isopropyl over it to get it sort of. Um, sterilized let's say and then we can see if i can take this to bits because um yeah it, probably there is a lithium site lithium cell inside which i yeah you can always use for any project that you like so just give me a moment to clean this up okay so um now keep in mind if you're working on something like this that there will still be some liquid inside i I think you can see that there is a bit of liquid left inside. Um, yeah, not sure if it shows up on camera, but there is still liquid inside. So um, you might spill some of this disgusting liquid that comes out. So be aware of that. I don't see any way to open this up apart from this tip. So let's just use brute force. <laughs> or let's see if we can get it open in another way. Does it? No, that's not gonna work, I think. Oh, maybe. I think I'm just gonna use brute force. I don't need this anyway. Oh, it doesn't grip very well. Yeah, that's not going to come off anytime soon, I think. It's probably glued in. It's really almost criminal that these things are made disposable. It's... Uh, it should be forbidden. I think here in Belgium, politics, they are starting to take action against these types of devices but uh it's still is it gonna come off no let's just it's gonna snap right <sighs> I'm butchering it quite badly, but uh, I think it's the only way to get this open. <sighs> 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 
yeah now the see the liquid is coming out that's why i have these paper towels here <sighs> yeah the liquid is out i'm just breaking things apart here let me Oh, the smell, it smells like, I don't know, it doesn't smell great. I don't understand why people want to inhale this, but hey, that's me maybe. Okay, so that's out. I can see the heater because this works. The reason why there is a battery inside is because um, it needs to heat up um, the liquid before you uh, inhale it. So... There is a heater element inside. Where is my wires? See, so that's the heater and there is the lithium. Whoa, that's a big cell. That's a... Uh... Wow! Oh no, 400 milliamp hour. Okay, that's a small cell. But in, in any case, it can be... Um... It smells like mint. Um... It can be quite convenient for your uh, for your own projects. So um, just gonna take it out and then throw everything away, which uh, the other parts which I have here because uh, it's quite disgusting. Um, there is a very tiny circuit board here. So what it does is detects when you inhale and then it activates the heater, which um, yeah generates the vapor. So but. Yeah, for that you need to have a power source and that's delivered by this lithium cell which is perfectly rechargeable but it's one time use because yeah you can't refill this or you can't replace the battery um, so then it's just tossed in the street it's just a waste it's uh, almost criminal let me get this battery out I'm just gonna snap it off here. Oh, saw that? Just activated the heater quickly. So that's the lithium battery, and that can now. Um, I can check it if it's still okay, um, and I can use it in a future project. Now, keep in mind that since this is not used to be recharged, it doesn't have a charge circuit or any protection circuit inside to avoid over or under charging so if you want to reuse uh, one of these batteries you still need to have a uh, recharge circuit so uh, but that's easily available online on aliexpress or something um, a way to safely charge these uh, cells so keep that in mind but anyway just a Quick video, just that uh, this is a bit more known that these things contain lithium batteries and I um, want to thank Clive for giving me this attention and I got just got myself a free lithium cell. So anyway, um, that was just a quick video on my channel. So thanks for watching and see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.